Hello and welcome to our channel. Today, we're going to talk about the recent earthquake in Turkey and the increase in natural disasters around the world, as well as the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. On March 4, 2023, Turkey was hit by a devastating earthquake that measured 7.3 on the Richter scale. The epicenter of the earthquake was in the eastern province of Van, and it was felt in many neighboring provinces as well. The earthquake has caused significant damage to buildings and infrastructure, and at least 100 people have lost their lives, with many more injured. Unfortunately, this is not an isolated incident. In recent years, we have seen a dramatic increase in natural disasters around the world, including hurricanes, floods, wildfires, and earthquakes. Climate change is one of the main factors contributing to this increase, with rising temperatures leading to more extreme weather events. But it's not just natural disasters that are affecting our world. The ongoing COVID-19 pandemic has had a profound impact on our lives and our societies. Over the past two years, we have seen millions of people infected with the virus, and hundreds of thousands of deaths. The pandemic has also had a significant impact on our economies, with many businesses forced to close and millions of people losing their jobs. The COVID-19 pandemic has also highlighted the vulnerabilities of our societies and the importance of preparedness. We need to take steps to better protect ourselves from both natural disasters and pandemics. This includes investing in disaster preparedness and response, improving infrastructure to withstand extreme weather events, and developing vaccines and treatments for emerging infectious diseases. In conclusion, the recent earthquake in Turkey is a tragic reminder of the increasing threat of natural disasters, and the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic has shown us the importance of being prepared for emergencies. We must work together as a global community to address these challenges and build a more resilient and sustainable future for ourselves and future generations. Thank you for watching.